I believe part of what my quest that I've been sharing with you, you know, when I had the rash and I got tired of some things, I finally said, okay, God, whatever I can, I want to be obedient to you. Whatever you tell me to do, that's my desire. I want that. I want that. I want that. And it was about, you know, a short time, a few weeks after that, when I heard the voice of the Lord say, declare war on sugar. Well, I don't really want that. I mean, literally, I was in my, I was in my little sauna meditating, and the Lord said, declare war on sugar. And I said, well, do we have to really go to war? You know, uh, can we kind of have a peaceful truce for a while? I mean, you know, for a few weeks, fine. But you're talking, I just knew he was talking about declare war. Man, I had to start treating it like an enemy. And I said, tiramisu is not my enemy. I wrestled with it, and I finally just said this. Okay, Father, whatever you want me to do, that's, what, that's, what, that's the greatest desire I have. That's the greatest desire I have is to be obedient to you. In the next two minutes, can I just share this little thought? You have the power to set your heart and set your face to go anywhere and do anything, to make money, to, to get a job, to get a wife, to get whatever, a promotion, whatever it is, and it will work. But does it not make a little sense to stop and say, what do I really want to set my face to go do? Does it not make sense to say, I want to obey, obey the Father? Jesus is going to Jerusalem to obey the Father. Well, I don't know if I really want that. Maybe I just present this. Do you know anybody that loves you as much as God does? Does anybody even come close to caring for you like he cares for you? Does anybody even come close to knowing you like he knows you? Does anybody else have near the wisdom that he has to help you get to where you really want to go? Does anybody have the wisdom to know what's really going to make you happy? Man, people ask me all the time about my opinion. What do you want? What do you want? And the truth is, I, they think I'm just avoiding them. They think whatever, that I, I'm indecision, which I am. And the truth is, I know something. I don't know much. I hear people say, what I really like is this, and I really like food like this, and I really like this. And when I hear them, it's almost like I'm a little bit envious because I can't say that. At the same time, when I watch them, I think they don't really know that. It's just simpler on their life to make a bold decision. I like my eggs this way and no other way. And so they don't ever have to make a decision about it. Because they never even tried the other way. I say, have you ever tried this? No, I hate it. Have you ever tried it? No. Especially grandkids. They don't even know. No way. Taste it. No. Buck and a half. No. Five dollars. No. They don't know what money is. <laughs> I'd do anything for five bucks almost. Especially taste something. What I'm trying to say is, I don't know, and, and truthfully, I know you don't either. You don't know what's really going to make you happy. You don't really know what's going, what you really want to do. All your decisions, all your blowing smoke and bold statements, everything else, is just kind of a cover-up because really you don't know. And you're so tired of exploring and trying to figure it out, you just want to say, I'm going to sell it. This is what I want. Anybody know what I'm talking about? Don't try to move me. And I go, you know something? I don't know what I like. In the other side, I found some things I used to like I don't like. And some things I, don't, I didn't like I do like. It makes sense for me to go to the guy that made me and say, you got the wisdom I'd like to know from you what I want. And I hear Jesus often say, what do you want? And when he does, I stop and think, okay, it's my choice. He's giving me the offer. I... And every time I come up with the same answer. I want what you want for me. Not because I'm skirting the decision, because I know there's nobody loves me more than you. There's nobody knows me better than you. And there's nobody's got the wisdom that you got to know about my future and where I need to get now, I want your will.